Well, at first, Austin police told us that they were actively looking for three suspects, but now they're saying that's no longer the case. Police say there are about five to seven people they are currently talking to who witnessed the shooting happen in one of these apartments you see here behind me. An officer says there were several people inside of the apartment. Senior police officer William Costello says one man about 20 years old was shot around 140 this morning. It happened in the 400 block of East William Cannon in South Austin. The shooting was at the Willowbrook Apartments. Austin Travis County EMS says a man who was shot was taken to a hospital with critical life threatening injuries. Paramedics were giving the man CPR as they were taking him to the hospital and he was later pronounced dead just before 2:30. Right now police are questioning several people who witnessed the shooting. There were numerous um, people in the apartment when this occurred and they're all uh, cooperating as far as uh, as far as right now and um, it's still an active investigation and um, there's no threat to the community it seems to be a very isolated incident and you can see that police have blocked off the area surrounding the location of the shooting. No suspects are in custody. Police are not sure what led up to the shooting, but that is something they hope to find out during the investigation. Well, police first said they were looking for three suspects involved in this shooting, but now they're saying that's no longer the case. There were about five to seven people inside one of these apartments behind me where police have blocked off that location. Five to seven people inside at the time of the shooting and they are being questioned by police. This shooting took place in the 400 block of East William Cannon here in South Austin. It was at the Willowbrook Apartments. Senior police officer William Costello says one man about 20 years old was shot around 140 this morning. That man was taken to the hospital with critical life threatening injuries. Paramedics were giving the man CPR as they were taking him to the hospital, but he was pronounced dead just before 2:30. Right now, police are questioning several people who witnessed the shooting. As of now, no suspects in custody. Police are trying to find out what led to this shooting that happened behind me. One of those apartments where police have it blocked off right now. Back to you in the studio. Well, Lauren, five to seven people have been questioned with Austin police for this shooting. They're not being called suspects at this point, but we're told a handful of them witnessed the shooting inside one of the apartments you see here behind me. It is blocked off this morning, but Austin police say a 20 year old man was shot just before two o'clock this morning and happened here off of William Cannon, just about half a mile off of I-35. It was the Willowbrook apartment complex. Medics transported the victim to South Austin Medical Center where he died shortly after. As of now, like I mentioned, no arrests have been made and police are talking to several witnesses. No word what led to this shooting. No arrests have been made. This is still an ongoing investigation and police have not released the identity of that man who was shot and killed earlier this morning. Back to the studio. Good morning, Dave. Police say they are questioning a handful of people that were inside one of the apartments at the time of the shooting. So far, no one has been arrested, but they are talking to about five to seven people. The shooting happened just before two o'clock this morning in the 400 block of East William Cannon here in South Austin. It was at the Willowbrook apartment complex. Senior police officer William Costello says one man about 20 years old was shot around 140 this morning. That man was taken to the hospital with critical life threatening injuries. Paramedics were giving him CPR as they were taking him to the hospital, but then they say the man was pronounced dead just before 2.30. Right now, police are questioning, like I mentioned, several people who witnessed the shooting. And you can see behind me that police have blocked off the area where the shooting took place. No word yet on the identity of that man who was killed or what led to the shooting here overnight. Dave. Lauren, that person is a man believed to be in his 20s. The shooting happened beyond this yellow police tape around 2 o'clock this morning. Police tell us that they are questioning and speaking with five to seven people who were inside of the apartment at the time of the shooting. Some of them were teenagers, and an officer says they were taken to the police station for that questioning to begin. We're told a 20-year-old man was shot, like I mentioned, before 2 o'clock this morning. It happened here off of William Cannon. The shooting is at the 
Willowbrook Apartments. Medics transported the victim to South Austin Medical Center where he did die shortly after. As of now, no arrests have been made and police are talking to witnesses. This is an ongoing investigation. We have noticed that homicide detectives are still here on scene as well as some of APD's crime unit. Back to you in the studio.